minutes. You said three, right? Yeah, three's fine. Three's fine. It's the Grease Pole Festival, everybody. Oh. Would you eat this? Would you eat this? I don't know. Would you? I don't know if I would. I think we had this one on the show last week. I know. This is going to be every single show, every season. This is going to show up. This is the best one ever. <laughs> All right, guys. Aside from Bob, we already food, know what this is. Don't forget to get the glizzy for the missy and the naughty taco for your vato. Let's go. Every week, gotta All get right, your glizzy. Guys, aside from bomb food, yeah, on our show, we don't the glizzy for the missy. Gotta get the glizzy and the taco for your guaco. All right, guys. Aside from bomb food. Don't forget to get the glizzy, glizzy for the Mizzy and, and, and the naughty work. taco for the guaco. All right, guys. Aside from bomb food. Ooh, the glizzy for the Mizzy and the and the taco for no. the naco. What? I'm still holding strong on in this day and economy, the way that gas prices are. Yeah. I'm going to get the glizzy because it's more. For this is why. you. Yeah. You get more for your for your for your dollar. I don't yeah. know, man. I don't know. I just don't. You should never put your hands in the water at Disney parks. Although Disney treats their water really well, there might be some things you lurking down like that, If you're dude? at Disney World in Florida, there's something- Where don't we pee? <laughs> now I gotta find it! <laughs> After but I'm just I took, saying. Like, Called four brain shots right now. That is commonly found Do in lakes in the area. This bacteria has any been any water <laughs> ever, anywhere, anywhere, ever. Mark here from Bama. Hi, Mark. Make sure you like. And subscribe. Follow and subscribe to the TP show. Thanks, Mark. I made the change, and now I don't pee in any water anywhere. That's good. You and the other one is, and, and the other one is, do not drink any water anywhere ever, specifically in to Disneyland. The reason why Disney left River Country abandoned. Underneath the water, there's a lot of metal components to the attractions that might slightly get rusty. If there's slightly. a small cut on your hand, putting slightly. your hand in the water could give you tetanus. People also scatter their loved ones' ashes in the water rides. When it happens, the attraction what? closes down and gets cleaned up to the best of their abilities. <laughs> you know, it's a small world after all, if you didn't know. Okay, so I've got questions. <laughs> First, you're taking oh, your dead loved one. Shots. You're taking dead loved yeah. ones and pouring them into Disney. Weird enough. The part that gets me is they figure it out and they shut the ride down. How did that happen? How did they figure it out? How did they go, oh, got to shut the ride down. Got to clean it out. Well, it, they probably don't dump it a little bit at a time. They probably take the whole urn and <laughs> put it in the water. <laughs> yes. And then there's this cloud of grandpa, you know. <laughs> I think I just sucked up grandpa. No. And, and why would you do it in Small World and not Pirates of the Caribbean? That's such a this better ride. This is why ride. you should never put it's your hands in the water at Disney Park. Yeah. Although Disney treats their water really well, do there that. might be some things lurking Duh. down there. If you're at Disney World in Florida, there's something called brain-eating amoeba that is commonly found in lakes in the area. Amoeba this bacteria has been speculated to be the, the reason why Disney left River Country oh. abandoned. Underneath the water, there's a lot of metal components to the attractions that might slightly get rusty. Thanks. If there's a small cut on your hand, putting your hand in the water could give you tetanus. People also no. Scatter their loved one's ashes in the water rides. When it happens, the attraction closes down and gets cleaned up. Although, I, I, mean, I, I have taken frothy peas before. Not that that's a good thing. <laughs> After drinking water from the uh, <sighs> dead people water. You know, I drink dead people. I do it. I wouldn't do it. Not at all. Mmm. So, mmm. My dying wish is to be poured into the teacup ride in Disney. I cannot the wait. Ride right? makes but sense are you ever eating because, eggs in it? Wait, 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 pause it, pause it. Yep, pause it. yep. Let me get the back to The teacup that. ride makes sense because you're spinning around at such a fast motion. If you dump grandpa or your grandma there, it just goes <laughs> everywhere. So everybody's eating grandpa or grandma or confetti or Lucy. for everyone. Like, yeah, they're like, "What is this? Is this a terrorist attack? No, that's my aunt." Is this anthrax? No, this is your aunt. No. Trixie. This Aunt Betty. You know. It's not anthrax. Wish. 
It's not anthrax. You have to be going 30 miles per hour in a circle, and then I dump the ashes, and it just gets everywhere. Goes right? everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere. This is what this looks good, right? But are you ever eating eggs and then it starts tasting too much like eggs? So then you feel like you have to stop eating it because it's gross now. I'm in that boat right now. Dude, this looks good, me. right? But what did you say? Did you did you agree with her? I agree. I agree. There's sometimes when you're eating a sandwich and it tastes too much like eggs and you're like, this is gross now because it tastes too much like eggs. Do are you ever time. eating eggs and then it starts tasting too much like eggs so then you feel like you have to stop eating it because it's gross now yes. i'm in that boat right now this looks good right it looks fantastic it, to me it doesn't it's missing all the important ingredients Jeez. i get it right? but are you but, ever but eating eggs like, and then it starts tasting like, too much like diet, eggs just eating like eggs and bread like yeah good? and it doesn't even look toasted like this is it does not look toasted so then you but, feel like you let me put it this way. That's a such sandwich. a white girl sandwich. It's like a white bread with egg, nothing on it. Doesn't even look like she put salt or pepper on it. Of course, it tastes too much like egg. You gotta put some sauce on it. It's a sauce. Where's the cheese? You don't got no toast. You got nothing. Yuck. Nothing. Back Have to the drawing board. You ever eat a sandwich and it now? tastes too much like egg, so you stop? No. Like, that's why I'm confused by this. I have. Like, I okay. Have. Well, clearly. I mean, I just, you you didn't put enough ingredients on it if it tastes too much like egg. You need, like, right. like some kind okay. of ham or some kind of cheese or sauce. Where's your sauce? You've got the bakwaki sauce, and you and you got, you take two or the three of the sauces, and you make the bakwaki sauce, and you put it on there. And then the gizzles and the zizzles. What the hell? We don't have anything about sauce. I wish we, <laughs> we did. Don't. We don't. Not yet. I just made it. I'm in that boat right now. This looks good, yeah. right? Yeah. No, not eating? to me. It doesn't. <laughs> I like the fact that she asked me if it looks good. No, it doesn't. Like my answer to you is no. It yeah, looks no. horrible. Yeah. You put no. You put no glizzy on the dizzy. <laughs> you didn't. <laughs> glizzy on the dizzy. You need your man to come out there and put the bukkake on it. <laughs> he just takes ketchup, mayonnaise, and like. <laughs> Squirt it at the same time. There you go. There's you your to be like, Have you ever stopped eating a sandwich because it tastes <clears throat> too much like bukkake? <laughs> well, I have. I have. Clearly. <laughs> Clear. Basically, I eat toilet paper okay. like all day, every day. What? No, I would not so eat it. Like it really, like it hits the spot. What? Wait. Excuse me. What? <sighs> what My brain just... needs a reset. Wait. Would you eat this? No, it's not a, it's not a food product. No, uh, you know, it really hits the spot when I'm eating toilet paper. Well, you need to give that guy right, in Ohio started. that toilet paper. Cause that guy in Ohio needs that toilet paper and you stole it from his ass. And now he's got to throw his poop on the ground. <laughs> Jesus. And guess what? Toilet paper has zero calories and it won't even give you really? over. I didn't even know. Some people might say that all toilet You're paper stupid. is the same. It's all created equally, and it's not. You're an idiot. Some people it's would say. It's the difference between I one ply I would just say you're toilet insane. paper and two ply. One ply is better. Like, you don't have to go through all the stress. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, when we're rating the ply of paperwork, a paper, toilet paper based on its edible factor, we know we've hit a new low. Like, <laughs> I like Angel Soft. Angel Soft is the one for me. <laughs> I used to like Cottonelle. That was so good. I, I used oh. to like Cottonelle. I used to. Charmin, oh, and you know. do you know the problem? Do you know the problem with this? Um, Where, where did we start? What were you thinking? No sauce. That's what I was thinking. No sauce. No bukkake. Instead so of trying to rip it apart, one ply is like eating the PB and J without the crust. Basically, I eat toilet paper like hey. all day. Every day. She, she compared it's that so to good. eating like, a really like, jelly without crust. It is the spot. Wait, what? <laughs> so if there was just a roll of toilet paper 
and a peanut butter and jelly sandwich uncrustable, she would be like, there's no difference. They're the no same. Difference. They're the same. They're the same. They're the same. Thing. They're the same. I don't I don't care if that's strawberry jelly, if that's Mucker's peanut butter, if that's crunchy peanut butter. I, I don't I don't care. Creamy or crunchy. I don't care. It's the same as it's, it's the same as my one ply. If it's yeah. One ply. One ply. I want I want the one ply. My question ply, is my question is, is the one ply like potato chips? Does she like add it to sandwiches? She like know. eating a sandwich and then in a one ply. And the sandwich you and a one ply. You know what she needs to apply for? Uh, medical disability because she's insane. Nah, what what TV show does she need to go on? Oh, she needs to go on the um, my weird fetish. Okay, not... I think that's where this is. But she oh. needs to go on naked and afraid because you get two items and one of them's toilet paper. So she would be good. She would. She'd spend be full. The whole... She'd be full the she'd whole be time. Fine. She'd be yeah. fine. Yeah. She'd be. The she'd be like. Be like the other guy would be like, I'm taking a shit. Where's the toilet paper? Sorry, I ate it. No, she just she it would just be hanging out her mouth. She'd be like, I don't know. Um I don't know. Which is I don't know where it is. This this toilet paper has a funky taste. Yeah, it, it, I'm wiping my ass with it, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Unlike the guy in Ohio who doesn't know what toilet what are you paper doing is. With, with the extra toilet paper around that shit. So I, I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh, and but no, I wouldn't eat that. That's just, it's really that no. easy. No. That one was the no. easiest one of the day. Easiest one it. of the day. Mm -hmm. <sighs> one, two, three, or four? Uh, two. Excellent. Because we were just talking about toilet paper. Number two. Here we go. So uh, say goodbye to everybody. Uh, we don't really have an outro, so we'll just play the intro again. That's what we need. We need an outro. Not that I would know what button to press. I wouldn't have any idea what button to press. I don't know what button to press. I think we're going to make this video an outro every single time. We've reached the end of an incredible journey together. We have. And I can't express enough gratitude for each and every one of you who tuned into the TP show. Thank you so much for showing up. Oh, that's so good. That is good. Oh, hello. What's up, motherfucker? Get out of my private pass. <laughs> so good. So good. This is the best video we watched all night. This is the best one ever. The best one ever. We're not watching anymore. We got best a minute and 20 seconds to oh kill. So I'm just going to stand here. We got to keep this one. We literally do have a you minute and 20 and seconds of this stuff. You have been the driving force behind this exciting adventure, and we couldn't have done it without you. We could not have. Whether you've been with us from the very beginning or just joined our family recently, your presence has made this show truly special. It has. Each like, comment, and share has warmed our hearts and motivated us to bring you the best content possible. If you enjoyed the TP show and the crazy roller coaster of emotions it took you on, don't forget to hit <laughs> that like button to let us know. It's not over when Your it goes black, means dude. means the world to us Here and helps us improve for future endeavors. And if you haven't done so already, make sure to follow us for more thrilling adventures, heartwarming uh, moments, my, my, and thought-provoking discussions. There's plenty more to come, and we want you to be a part of it. Once again, thank you for being a part of our journey. We cherish your support and can't wait to embark on more adventures together. Spread the word about the TP show to your friends and family, and let's build this amazing community. Like, follow, and share the TP show to join the fun and be part of our incredible community. Thanks, everybody. Oh, hello. What's up, motherfucker? Get out of my private pass. <laughs> Right as we were live. Oh my god, that was so good. I'm gonna stop the recording. That was so good.